With us we have Namibia's um, African bantamweight interim champion, Emmanuel Nigella. Ims, you had a fantastic 2011 winning five fights and becoming the WBO interim champion. Tell us a bit about your year. Um, thank you. Uh, our, my year was um, my year was a very grateful year. I, mean, I had five fights this year. They were all I won them all. Um, it went for me. It was a very productive and successful fight. I mean, year for me this year. Right now, you've also um, a new hope in Namibian boxing ranks. I think you've impressed the fans with your tremendous hand speed and your ring craft. Where does that come from? You know, the ring craft. Uh, you know. Uh, uh, when I, when 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 Nessa looked at the thing of me being friends, you know, he came up with an idea of me wearing the crown, and then uh, he, we did it when I first fought on 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 the third of August, and it was uh, I did perform, and usually what happens is um, it, it gives me more a much of encouragement and more motivation when I when I enter in that side, I always um, expect to deliver, and I do deliver. Right now, as we say, we had uh, fantastic performances by you. And you now also ranked um, quite highly. What are your plans for and, and your expectations for 2012? Uh, you know, my 2012, I know it's going to be a busy year. Uh, it's a busy and a bit of tougher year because, uh, you know, the more you rank, um, the, the tougher you get and the tougher opponents you get as well. Because everybody wants to beat you since you became, now you, are, you I mean, the whole world is now watching over me and they all want to kind of like have a test on who, I mean, when they say, no, maybe I got the Panamoy champion and, they want to see for themselves and they see if they can beat him and see if, they, if he's really worth what the people are saying. So I'm expecting a very tough year. But yeah, I'm going to work uh, hard as usual and do just the same thing. Right, and Ims, maybe tell us, um, personally, you did have a bit of a, a tragedy with your mother dying in 2011. Mm -hmm. um, what role has the she play and also in your fights? You mentioned that she's still playing a big role for you. No, oh, my, mom, my mom was one. My mom is a... Uh, She's my kind of like my inspiration. She's been uh, she's been there for me throughout when I started my boxing, my professional boxing. She she really wanted me to succeed. You know, she she to me like now uh, when she passed away, I actually I was actually I don't know whether I was shocked or but I think after the passed away of my mom, I just became a stronger and a better person, and I think she's still watching over me. So. Yeah, I'm, I'm, and whenever I am right now, I still kind of like think when I still need to make it happy.